'Twas the night before Christmas, Joker style, by Miss Jinx. 'Twas the night before Christmas, and all through the yard, not an object was swaying, for the wind blew not hard. The lights were hung on the roof way up there, in hope that the neighbors would grumble and glare. The pumpkins were gone, all replaced by snowheads. While the wind blew sharp frost to the door, I was led, and the house and its ornaments, and I in my coat, had one thing in common: some plum and a joke. When out from the distance, I'll rouse such a siren. I sprang through the door, so fast, nearly flying, away to the kitchen. I hopped like a hare, tore open the fridge, and ate what was there. The moon high in the sky it glowed through the window, illuminating the objects below. When what to my wandering eyes should appear but a honey glazed ham on the counter? Oh dear! With a spring in my step and a stomach like a pit, I proceeded to wolf down every single bit. More frantic than starved mice, my eyes did they scan the whole moonlit living room and the tree by the fan. Now what a tall and white thing you are! A tree such as yourself should be bright as a star. Away from that unflattering fan, I'll pull and set you ablaze. A fire for the fools. In flames up it went, like dry leaves in the cold. But then that's what it was, or so I was told. To the door left wide open, I merrily skipped, pulled a card from my pocket, and dropped it with a flick. And then through the roars of the heated flames, a snap and a click from the window he came. As I slipped into the yard, still quiet, undisturbed, I heard a crash and a growl. This man, how absurd! The man donned in black from his head to his foot. I imagine no difference when covered in soot. From my spot by a tree, some ways from the wreck, he burst out heroically. Two bodies in check. His judgment so righteous, his sense so lacking. Did he not know of the girl inside hacking? To the street he marched with his saved in tow, where the engine sat waiting, awestruck by the show. The fire raged on, not yet seized by the law, for the hydrant I knew would take hours to thaw. <laughs> As I chuckled and laughed on the cold, icy ground, I was vaguely aware of the house now a mound. Now on my side, the wind became colder and flew over my head as I watched the wood smolder. With my smile stretched wide and paint frozen stiff, I couldn't help wonder of that jolly old myth: a man aged thousands, filled with nothing but cheer. Surely the creator's head wound was severe. The thought discarded, the wonder dispersed. I picked myself up, no longer immersed. And as I walked off, the night still assured. I said to myself, "That tonight I'm still bored." Have a merry and safe Christmas, everybody. <laughs>